Hi, Mr. Frey. Welcome to our show. So um, one of the keywords in your films can be journey. So what's your understanding of finding a good story or a new perspective um, in the journey of filmmaking? Indeed, my films are journeys, but also the way I work is it's always a moment in my life when I read something, when I have an encounter by, you know, reading a, a moment uh, and then I embark. It's an epiphany. I really never start with a movie like going in a general direction. I need first to kind of, you know, link emotionally to something. And uh, that's how I embark. And I feel uh, documentaries can be actually journeys. And they go with you, with the audience, to unknown places also. They can maybe surprise you. But they definitely also mm, should, in my opinion, not only go to the places we already know, not just, you know, do what tourists do. They should bring me into a new world and link me emotionally to people. And from my understanding, a documentary can also sometimes tackle the most important topics facing humanity in the modern world. What's your philosophy about life in terms of creative experiences? I was really interested in human beings who are rejected in love and can't let go. It's like an addiction. And love brings you to very basic questions of life, you know, why are we here and how, you know, who is reflecting on our lives. So yes, I uh, always try to find topics which are kind of universal. I feel there is uh, a need for documentaries. Uh, I always like to quote Patricia Guzman, who is our Chilean uh, colleague, and he once said, you know, a, a country without documentaries, it's like a family without a photo album. We are the photo album the family can also look into and reflect and discuss the family history. In the world of documentaries, everybody can shoot the documentary now, you know. I mean, we have these smartphones and they're technically capable that you can go to the big screen I myself produced a film which was entirely uh, shot on a smartphone. The storytelling is still the same challenge. So there is no advantage for young people when it comes to the technique. It's a lot of advantage because they might know better how to deal with all these uh, digital gadgets. But when it comes to storytelling, uh, it's still a matter of intelligence, of in really being capable to sort out many layers of when it comes to documentary, because you, we, we are storytelling tellers, we are storytellers, but we, we are working with real people, you know, with real human beings. So this is a lot of responsibility and challenges. And this is, uh, I mean, when you ask about new talent. I don't think there is an, ad an advantage to be young in documentary filmmaking, but I'm often uh, surprised, you know, in a very positive way.